Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Weapon Showcase and series episode 3 and an extremely obnoxious medic in the corner there, so we're gonna risk going outside to do the introduction. And uh sure time risk it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's do it here. So, 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 so today is episode 3, so we're gonna get the power, we're gonna get the detonator, plus 25% damage itself, and all fire detonates a flare. Let me talk about the flare guns in general. The flare gun is a projectile arc, which means that it, I mean, projectile, yeah, it's a projectile that makes an arc, that, so it makes a little curving when it's traveling, so it doesn't go straight like a bullet would. When it makes target with a player, it causes them to ignite, Ugh, not like that, but it causes them to ignite. Which it's very useful because you're a pirate. I mean, you want to set stuff on fire because you're some sick, twisted man who wants to spread rainbows and bubbles along living. But it's probably easier to show you guys what it looks like instead. This is a detonator. It has a special ability that regular flare guns can, which you could detonate. That way, it doesn't have to exactly hit the target to set them on fire. You can just kind of hit. Next, shoot next to them and then blow it up. Kind of like that. You see, you see that's what detonator does. Same with that. Well, another thing about detonator is that, uh, about flare guns in general is that they they crit targets. Uh, everyone's going to try to grab them. They they crit targets. It's, uh, the, the default flare gun it just crits burning targets, which which means it's a 90 that it does 90 damage on a burning player. The detonator, because of a special ability, only mini crits burning targets. So it's not the fact that, oh, you could just shoot next to them, light them on fire, I mean, when they're already on fire, blow up the detonator, and it'll automatically become a, a crit damage, which, you know, probably you know, very, very overpowered, but no, mini crits them. So it does about 40 damage, so about half the damage of a crit would. But as I showed you right there, you don't have to actually shoot them. Just shoot them in the crowd, blow it up, and it does damage. Let me see if I can try to kill a guy with it. Personally, the detonator is not my favorite weapon because it's loud and obnoxious. Let's do it. Sounds like fireworks on the 4th of July in the middle of August. You know how obnoxious that is? You, you, you don't want to hear fireworks in the middle of July, August, 4th of November. No, you don't. I mean, it's, it's loud. It's, let's do it. <laughs> sounds like, it sounds like a dying wombat. I don't know what that sounds like, but I'll only assume that a wombat sounds like that. Now, that name will probably be best paired up with a different flamethrower, which I will show you as soon as either lose or win. But, hey, look, light everyone on fire. There's no one who will not be on fire at the end of this. Ugh! Yay! Yeah, you shall all fear my rat. No, why'd you kill him? That was my kill. Soldier, get back here! Get back here! No, that was my kill! That was my kill. So, the, the, the flamethrower that I best think pairs up with it is with obviously the degreaser. Why the degreaser? It's, it's faster weapon switch. Look at that, faster weapon switch. That means you, make, you could just light them, air blast them, and then hit them with a the flare. All mech mini crit. It's a very good combo and a lot of people utilize it. The Vault Flamethrower is mainly used, supposed to be used for, you know, new players, which is why it's a default, which is a default Flamethrower. You just run around going blah 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 blah. Meanwhile, I get backstabbed even though I'm a pyro. Good job. Now, I want to take a second right here to talk about the Degreaser, even though this is a showcase for the... Sh sh yeah, sh showcase for the Detonator. The, the Degreaser... It's mainly supposed to be used as a combo weapon. It's also supposed to be relatively easy to reflect rockets, but I'm not good. I'm a terrible player. I suck. I'm terrible at air blasting. I'm just incredibly horrible. You can all see I don't think I'm too bad, but I'm not. I'm just, air blasting is very, very difficult for me. I don't know why. It's just really. Easy. But the degreaser, let's talk about the degreaser a little bit more. The degreaser is a combo weapon because it does less damage, but it has a faster weapon switch. We so it's, you, it's really meant for just lying someone on fire and letting a different weapon do the rest. For instance, for in, in this instance, the detonator. 
if you don't hit a if you don't hit a wood pulse like that and actually do that, then it's very it's a very viable weapon, I suppose. But it can't be them as bomb because they just easily go back and heal up again. Probably isn't the best way to show. Another thing, it's not very good against other pyros. Just uh, okay, that's a computer. Uh, I'm doing so bad at the pyro today. Usually I can just get the pyros. Detonate. Oh, it's the detonator. It's loud and obnoxious. Like the firecracker from Left 4 Dead 2. Except a lot worse. It's, it's, the hit detection on this thing is so weird. It's, 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 it's a weird pyro. It's, it's a weird laggy pyro. Hey, scout. Uh, oof. Move your stupid scout. Uh, no. Yeah. You get axed. Sorry. I, I honestly did not think I was going to survive that. I mean, I was being cornered by a by Pyro and I was being body blocked by a scout that was lagging to no end. So I got him with an axe on my own. I got the Pyro with the axe. I'm gonna spawn cap these guys because it's, it's a lakeside. If it wasn't, if we weren't spawn capping, then we wouldn't be doing this the right way. But here, let me see if I could give. Let me see if I can't show you an example of the mini crits. No, apparently I can't because I'm terrible at hitting people while I'm air blasting them. I'm, I'm literally pinning them against the wall and I just still can't hit them. I'm a. I'm. Oh, Pyro. Uh, uh, that, that soldier saved the pyro. I don't give a fuck that day. Look at that beautiful pyro. So, we're gonna try to get some more detonators. I'm trying to get a mini crit detonator. When I tried recording this before, before TF2 crashed on me, I got. No, oh, come on! Oh, no! That was a. Yeah. That pyro is obviously a spy. He's a he, he spy pyro. Hey, hey. Hey, spy pirate. There you go. Uh, you're not you're not dead. Yeah, come on. Come on. Get that needed. Yes! There you go. So you saw how it was mini created there. The 35 damage instead of the default 20 or so. Oh, it's a pyro! Pyro's only weakness. Another pyro. Makes complete sense. Makes complete sense. Oh, oh. And I was happy that I was mini critic too. Uh, why snappers always got when I start? The hunch of a snapper. You have a real snapper, they're bowman. Or you think you are some kind of RPG person? You're gonna use you're gonna use twin shot and double shot and piercing shot and I seem to have forgotten my manners. This is King of the Hill Harvest Final Harvest. Oh, it doesn't matter which version of Harvest it is, to be honest. I can never tell the difference. I just join Harvest and pick Harvest. And the reason why I like it so much is because it's so open. The open map and open maps are always good for weapon showcases because it really shows how well they do in the open environment. No, I'm just joking. It's just easier to find the enemy and it's easier not to get choke pointed, so it's easier to corner that enemy and therefore, you know, I can show what the weapon can do. Hey, you get axed. Just axe. Play a song for the pyro. Uh, let's go get some more dudes. Oh, we won. I mean, yay, we won. Where's the, where's the scout? Come on, you detonate this dude. Come on, come on, you stupid scout. Oh, you got him. Hey, high five, snapper. No, you went the wrong way. No, give me a high five. No, 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 you got No. Hey, snapper, snapper, give me a high five. If you don't give me a high five, I will murder your family brutally. How about you spy? You want to high five me? Yeah, oh. Yeah, you rule, bro. Yeah. Gotta high five, now motivate him. Gotta get some more detonators. Get him with some, get him more detonators. Ooh, come on. Come on, let me light you niggas on fire. No, it's a, it's, it's a, it's a gun. It powers only weakness. Ugh. Oh, what's that? Hey, give me half. Oh, you can't see me through that door. Come on, where'd you scout? Where'd yeah. Oh, you got air blasted. How you like me? Mm. This is becoming more of a showcase for the degreaser than for the. Personally, I really do not like that If I, I prefer the default flare gun to the that I mean, the only reason that is is because it's. it's I, I, I think that the, the exploding flare is just kind of a gimmick. It's. It, the, the, it's it ha, you have no sense of direction when a flare is. I mean, you have no sense of how large an area is when the flare goes so far. So when it reaches really far away and then you blast it, thinking that's near the point, it might be miles away, you never know. And I don't, never knew exa know exactly how large the explosion is. The explosion may seem really large, but if I get someone. It just brushes up against their side. It still doesn't light them on fire. It's, uh, sometimes it does. Sometimes it doesn't. 
Well, one another key feature about the detonator though is that you can flare jump with it. Flare jump, kind of like rocket jumping, shoot at the ground and you launch yourself in the air a little bit. It does a lot of damage, especially since the flare detonator does more, you know, to self damage. It, the only reason self damage is there is because the, the, the detonator can do that. Okay, there you go. Thanks, Snapple. But yeah, the only reason that the plus 25% damage is there is because you can do the little flare jump. It's, it's nothing more than a little hop. You can jump generally higher than you can, but I don't know. Maybe you could do some. Yeah, you could do some fancy uh, rocket jumping stuff with it too. I wonder if you could pogo. Yeah, you could do a little. Yeah, you could do uh, anything that you could do with a rocket launcher. You could also do with a flare. Just do a much less extent and do much more damage wise. I'm talking about it right there too. I thought I had him. It looked like it was really close, but it was nowhere near him apparently. Because it didn't light him on fire. It didn't light him to the fire. I, I did get that. I did get that. Uh, Come on, soldiers. I want you. I want you. Oh. Mm. Yeah, who needs an extinguisher? No, oh, that was obviously a dead run spy. Yeah, head for the health pack. Will you survive before then? I guess not. Tune in next time too. Will that spy survive from Dead Rain? The show comes out every three seconds because every single spy from Dead Rain survives. Freaking Dead Rain survives. Uh, hey, snap up! Oh, you just got made crazy with the detonator. Would it have been more effective with a flare gun? Who cares? Hey, sniper! You too. You want some? Uh, you want some? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Oh, you should've just gotten me. You should've just come at- You should've just came after me, bro. But nah, you ran away. That's what you got. You got axe, though. They're all shit. There he is. Uh, uh, no! That's what you get for not killing me. You get axed. I like- You got the axe. You got the axe extinguisher. You, you get the detonator. That's what the showcase is about. It's about the detonator. Why do I keep forgetting? Because I'm stupid, that's why. Come on. Come on. Good detonator! Yeah, I don't need to aim. Well, who cares about oh see look I got him see, in some cases like this where the area is so small where they're trying to camp is it you know, I can't get them I mean it's not safe to rush in with the same door I could get them pretty decently well hey, and this is another episode of Kimbala's Dead Ringer Spy he didn't survive but anyways you you can see what I mean like in small instances like this hallway a detonator could be it's, very, it's pretty good I'm not gonna lie that the detonator is really good in small choke points personally I don't like playing in choke pointed areas so uh, I get that. I guess that's why I don't like the detonator. Besides, the flare gun. Most of the time, I get my flares anyways when I air blast them in the air obnoxiously. Even scouts who can double jump, they just double jump and then I just blast them up again. And look, he's dressing up like me. I don't know who he is. Time for another episode of Will this Dead Ringer Spy Survive? Will he? Will he? I guess he would not. Oh, look, it's another episode of Will the Dead Ringer Spy Survive? Wait, wait. It's, it's, I can't tell who's who. Who's my teammate? I don't, dude, what is a teammate? Uh, come on, come on. Get detonated. Yeah, come on. So I seem to have, oh look. So I, I think I may have misspoken because uh, a detonated player will not mini crit. You must hit the player to mini crit. I'm not sure, uh, uh, you, if you guys have a uh, Mis misunderstood me by that. No, well, it won't have been misunderstood because I kind of believed it myself. I thought that if you, you know, detonated, then it, gets, it doesn't give you many crits. It's regular damage. So if, if you if you think that it will definitely hit it, don't. If you think it'll definitely hit the person, don't detonate and you get many crits. If you know that it won't, or you're just guessing where they are, like some guys normally come around here. So I'm just gonna throw around here and detonate. It. So yeah, I mean. It's some, it's, Like in some cases, like this, I could generally tell where they're gonna land, except I didn't and I failed horribly. But in this case, where they're so close off, come on, come on. Yeah, I don't want to die. I don't want. Oh, I died. Why is it always that it seems to be pirates that are killing me in these showcases? Even when I'm a pirate. Doesn't seem to make any sense. So, I don't think I'm putting the detonator to get huge here because I'm going around and I'm not actually. I'm not. I'm not actually mini critting anymore. Look, I, I never get to mini crit that guy. I don't get. I'm not mini critting the dudes. I need, I need a mini crit to do. That's the whole point of the 
flare guns is that you get the crit bonus. I mean, the whole point of the detonator, I suppose, is that you can blow it up. Like, in this instance, I know he's... Oh! Oh, I've got the crit... Get the crit detonator. I know where you are. Hey, soldier. How are you? Hey, it's the pyro. I like that guy. Give me a half-half, scout. Oh, I guess not. So, I think I've said enough to say about detonator. You... Shoot like a regular flare gun, and but detonates when you press right click. You could hit on the floor, you could do a little little hop off the ground. You could also, you know, jump, hit the other thing. I don't know, it's the flare gun. It's not really good for jumping. It does 25% more damage, so don't just do it willy nilly. You'll take, you'll take what, 20 damage? That's a lot. That's a lot of health. No, that's 40 damage. Whoa, that's a lot of health. But look, you, could, you can clear up stuff like that high, so. I mean, in some cases, it is pretty good. It does let you. Uh, go well, pretty high, but I, I wouldn't use it like you would rocket jumping. Uh, not at all. Especially since a power so squishy, and you only got short range weapons anyway. So if somebody with a long weapon, like we, it's a long weapon, really, really long. Oh, oh, see, look. And don't forget about the mini crits. It does the mini crits. You you don't detonate them. It hits a lightning vic. It hit a lit target. Close range, 45. Long range, something else. I don't know. But that's a detonator. Check it out, I guess. Personality prefer the default flare gun. In some cases, like a narrow choke point is very good. It lights everyone on fire. But anyway, guys, let me guys you off with a little song. See you guys next time. See, I made it. Alright, if you fail this one, I'm just gonna tell. Oh, actually, that's it. Ah, oh, fucking shit! Ugh, I just got milk. Got handled the milk. Uh, I got oh my god, like a fucking group of. Help okay. me, you really have to help me right now. 